Very big indeed. Well, still undefeated. That's where the Muhlenberg women stand after four overall games and two into the Centennial Conference schedule. Haverford came to Memorial Hall last night looking for its first ever win there and carrying the burden of an 0-23 record on the Mule's home court. This game was expected to be over by halftime, but the Fords had other ideas. Muhlenberg went into the contest ranked 21st in the first D3Hoops.com poll. Haverford was winless in two starts. Aaron McSherry blocks a shot in the game's first minute for career number 115. The senior still needs two more to become the school's all-time leader in swats. Make that swats. <laughs> the Mules missed their first eight shots, but Caitlin O'Malley makes the steal here. And Alexis Bates scores with four and change into the game. The first half featured seven lead changes. Watch the nice feed from Allie Lieberman to Natalie Richmond. Muhlenberg led by just three points, 28 to 25 at halftime. Haverford continued to stay close into the second half. Kathleen Abels drives baseline for two of her game high 21 points and ties it up 30 all. Senior Lauren Boyle had her usual quality outing. The swing player pops the J on her way to 15 points. The margin was just 41 to 40 mules with 11 minutes remaining before Muhlenberg served up some spicy chili. Alexandra Chili, that is the freshman sensation with a three. During a Mule's 12-2 run, Chile also dished out three stellar assists to go along with four three-pointers over the final 10 minutes. Chile with another dish, this time to Kelly McKeon, who rang up her second double-double of the season with, with 11 points and 10 rebounds. Chile bombs away again to give Muhlenberg a comfortable 64-50 lead with 4-10 to go. Mules go on to beat Haverford for the 33rd straight time, 68 to 55. Chile finishes with 15 points and six assists. The reigning conference player of the week ties the school record for freshmen with five trays for the second straight game. How was that Chile, Coach Roan? We're still trying to figure out if she's scoring more than she's giving up on the defensive end because she is a freshman. Uh, so we're, we're working on that. But I think she just needs to get out there and keep playing and be comfortable. Uh, I think as a freshman, sometimes she doesn't assert herself early enough in the game because she respects the upperclassmen a lot and doesn't want to seem like a ball hog. But, you know, if I could shoot like that, I'll tell you, I'd be shooting it a lot. I don't know. I think it's just all about comfort level. Like, it's just my first couple games, just getting used to new playing, new team, and just the more I get in the games, the more comfortable I'll be, the more... Um, op not optimistic, more confident, though, that I'll make those passes. We were pretty deep, so um, to get chemistry is kind of... Um, again, it's tough a little bit, but, um, you know, Chili really came out there today. She hit her three. She's really been showing up to play. And, um, you know, if we keep practicing and, you know, working through it, I think we're going to be really good. I don't think we played down. I just don't think we were as sharp as we needed to be, either offensively or defensively. You know, we didn't play strong enough inside and finish off a lot of plays. We didn't shoot the ball well outside. And then defensively, I think we were just a step behind everything. Uh, and maybe that's a little bit mental preparation going into the game. I think we have to be a little bit sharper uh, to do that because it gives us some confidence. And they got one or two players. And Lattice All-22 is a great athlete. You let her get on a little bit of a run, and then she gets some confidence, and then she's hitting shots you can't stop. Yeah, those Muhlenberg gals have a lot on their plate mm -hmm. these days. They're playing five conference games, and I meant rather three conference games in a span of five mm -hmm. days with Swarthmore tomorrow and then Franklin and Marshall Saturday, as well as exams coming up. Chili served just right in West Allentown last night. Just I, proper. Just yes, perfect. Just perfect. <laughs>